The EFS 1755mm f2.8 IS USM is Canon's first part option for high performance delivered on its APS-C market. Simply the best standard zoom for cameras like the Rebel 80 or 90Ds or the 7D series, it offers equivalent focal range to a 27-88mm lens, now with a built-in stabilizer and ring-type ultrasonic AF. At 83 by 110 mm of 645 grams of mostly plastics, unfortunately the first thing we notice on the $1000 EFS 1755 f2.8 is the build quality, not as tough as the L series, despite the price and the target market. Made of high quality plastic over a metal mount, with a large and easy to use zoom ring, the main issue is stand with its subpar construction of the zoom mechanism feeling fragile, it collects incredible amount of dust inside, settling over the zooming tracks or the first optical elements. It's a big problem for the overall usability, because it makes the lens perform worse as time goes by, so I would carefully recommend for those looking for an investment on the APS-C format, you're paying a lot of money for a not so great product. What it does right is the ring type USA motor, that's the highlight of the model. It offers near instant AF performance, now for mid tier cameras paired to a constant f2.8 aperture, paired to the all internal built in stabilizer that offers up to 3 stops of shutter speed compensation for camera movement, and you have a super flexible lens, all on a single package on the smaller APS-C format. Finally at the front, the EFS 1755 accepts large 77mm filters, fix over the first optical element, avoiding flaring and vignetting. At the rear, the metal mount sports Canon rubber bump to avoid mounting it on full frame cameras as the optical design doesn't cover the 135 image circle. Despite the high price, Canon doesn't supply it with a lens hood nor carrying case, and it feels less premium than other spears, especially comparing to Sigma Art series. But overall, this is a very flexible lens, indeed offering the best Canon features in focusing and image stabilization. With a very complex 19 elements in 12 groups optical formula, sporting advanced technologies including 3 spherical elements and ultra low dispersion pieces, what the EFS 1755 f2.8 ISU SMs delivers optically is good, worse than expected, but on an issue not recommended. The problem is the overall resolution f2.8. Some details bloom over high contrast lines of hairs, faraway bricks, leaves and high frequency details, making me question the extremely complex optical formula. The images lack details of f2.8 and the large aperture must be used only under extreme low light, made to facilitate exposure, not to deliver different images. Stopping down greatly enhances details despite some visible chromatic aberration. It is a big boy's performance delivered on the smaller format, but only from f4 to f8, it doesn't happen at f2.8. The frame geometry is well handled, good for using straight lines to frame your composition, and finally yes, better than most zooms. And despite this all black and white video, my article on this lens shows good examples with colors that are vibrant and easy to post-process. So overall this is actually a difficult review, a weird construction sucking dust inside the lens a good focusing performance paired to a great stabilizer. But the images, after all, are not any better than other EFS 1855 kit zooms, and I do question its flexibility. So I carefully recommend it for those requiring constant f2.8 apertures, be it to shoot low light action, or for those looking for the best AF performance on the APS-C, easily delivered by this lens. But no, it's not a better lens than most kits, and I've seen many users purchasing it expecting better results that it simply won't deliver. So you have to be wise about its purchase. It's made for low light with the f2.8 NIS, but not anything else. So if you're looking for a better kit zoom lens, I would recommend a different focal length or a better zoom performance from the L series. But I do understand the EFS 1755's place on Canon's history. It's just harder to justify it today, so nice shooting.